Gucci. <laughs> oh, I can't. I can't say that. You go ahead. Okay. <laughs> what was the question again? <laughs> Let's do it again. Beep. Bloom is about a young university student who finds himself living kind of against his will in an aged care home. It's the story of uh, him learning to come to terms with, understand and respect the people in that home and, and they in turn learning from him. I wanted to be part of it because I love making new musicals and it's a really rare opportunity to make a new Australian musical. And I also am a massive fan of Tom Gleisner and Working Dog's work over the last couple of decades. They've done huge cultural touchstones in Australia, things like The Castle, obviously, but even shows like Frontline were really pivotal to me in how you can tell smart, funny stories, which are the kind of stories I'm really drawn to. I've spent a fair bit of time in and around aged care over last decade or so with various parents and parents-in-law. So I've kind of got to know the world pretty well and it's, it's a fascinating place. It's, uh, I think everybody comes in contact with it. Either you're in there as a resident or you're looking after someone who's in as a resident. I think that the show is both unique and not unique in, in a sense that it's so relatable. Do you yes, know what I'm saying? Yeah, like yeah, yeah. I've never seen a show like this on stage. I've never seen a mobility scooter yeah, um, you know, and, and, and it's a workplace as well, isn't yeah. it? So it's very relatable. We all know that they exist, and I think most of us have probably had some experience. I think it's it's kind of shining a light on the on the people that care for the or you know care for the people in the homes. What I'm enjoying most about this character is having the opportunity to show that in within every old person old person there's still a child and a youth mm, and an yes. adolescent and that's still bubbling away beneath the surface so to give a voice to aging in the and to do it in a musical where it's sort of both funny and moving and you know it's got grit in it and and is really powerful and important the most unique thing about the production is the kind of generational crossover we've got characters as young as 21 and as old as 82. There is a wonderful interaction between us more experienced performers and a couple of young leads that we have in the show. I think it's, it's really feeling like a family, don't you think? We learn from each other, um, always. It's a big circle. We're closing the generation gap, yeah. that's what we're doing. That's a great thing to say. So unique to hear that blend of voices, to hear a 20-year-old singing with a 70-year-old and what sound that makes as a group is... There's no 70-year-olds, isn't there? I think the, the music complements what's going on on stage. The contemporary and the classic sounds that you'll hear in the music. You know, we've got a bit of pop rock and there's a little bit of classic song and dance going on as well. So it's, it's really supporting that. And there's some Chopin. There's some Chopin. She didn't write that, that was... I wish. Chopin. I think that all the songs um, have really reflected each character quite well. Um, even the genres, like a lot of different genre swaps and the um, really playful and really fun music that just will get stuck in your head for sure. It's a bop. It's a jam. It's a vibe. There's pastiche in there. There's MGM. There's a bit of Sarah Bareilles and Jonathan Larson. There's 90s. It's current. It's its, it's own unique sound. There's a lot of heart in her songs and some of the sadder numbers. I'm crying most of the time when I hear them. Her song's incredible. It makes me cry because <laughs> it's that bad. Because <laughs> she's incredible, this oh. voice here. It's amazing. Good music goes past the logical brain, you know, mm. and it affects the body. And I feel like the music in this show really does. Mm -hmm. Also, Tom's lyrics help yes, that, you know. That Tom's they, lyrics. That they, because they work together so well, they've melded the music and the lyrics so, you know, seamlessly. It's good to tell a story through song and have it so clear because Tom's written those lyrics. It's a musical and it's a comedy, but it also, it's done in a very, I, I feel, in a very respectful way. Mm. You know, we're, we are telling a story set in an aged care home, but we're not taking the mickey of, of these things. And it touches on the serious matters that are addressed in, in anything to do with aged care, but um, it's not lecturing or, but, or Yeah, lecturing. and it doesn't pull you down, it doesn't, you know. No, it, you won't it, be pulled down yeah. by it, you'll be lifted uh, up, yeah. absolutely lifted yeah. up. Absolutely. In fact, you come and see it, you'll bloom. <laughs> see how I did that? See what I'm doing there?